Cross family. Hey guys. What are you having, Em? You having some avocado? Mmm. Looks tasty. Hi, Mom. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning, Liam. Hey, little fella. How are you? Nice to see you. Oh, I just checked my YouTube account. I have 80 subscribers and 5,000 views. It's more, more subscribers every day than the day before. 10 new subscribers last night. 10 Very new. Cool. Yeah, it's a lot. And I got a, uh, I got a question, I got a comment asking how we met. Ooh. So I have to tell the story today at some point. Yeah, should. Yeah. Do your chores. Go dust. You gonna dust? Dust the, this one. It's dusty over there. Come on, baby. That's this one. This part right here. You missed it. <laughs> Thank you. There's my little helper. Thank you, baby. I'm... Do you really need that many colors of no, eyeshadow? I don't. I don't really need that many colors of eyeshadows, but other people does. Because they use it for a living, like makeup artists, oh. and you're just getting ready. You're just getting ready to go to the grocery store. It's not like you need. I'm doing an everyday makeup, everyday natural look. What does that mean? It means it's not too dramatic of a look oh. compared to like other makeup look, like a glam look. That means neutral colors. I don't even know what these words mean. <laughs> you ask. Everyday makeup look, glam makeup look. Glam makeup look is when there's a special occasion or you want to go out at night or there's a wedding you have to attend to or uh -huh. you're the bride of the wedding. <laughs> That's the glam look. Uh, okay. Well, we're just going to the grocery store, so <laughs> let's keep it simple. I am keeping it simple. Okay. I love you. Carry on. You're so judgy. I'm not judgy. I'm being supportive. I'm inquisitive. You are. You're like, yeah, we're just going to the grocery store. Keep it simple. <laughs> yeah. Is that how I talk? That's how you talk. Keep it simple. <laughs> Who's all ready for adventure? Bye. Yep. Ready? Hi. Hi, Liam. Say hi. You getting all buckled in too? He's like shivering. Oh. A little bit. So. It'll be over soon. Hey, Mike. <laughs> What's going on with your sideburn? Hold on. I'll go. This guy has a multicolored hair. <laughs> if you can see, like it's like it starts with black and then it transitions to red. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> okay, hold on. Here's your snack. Here you go. Here you go. <laughs> what you doing? You saying hi to people? Oatmeal for her? Okay. 
Oh yeah? So many choices, huh? Yeah, so many choices. Yes, Daddy. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Emma, you saying hi to people? Hi. This girl, like where, where, whenever we pass by people, he, she says hi. It's so funny, cute. The people like loves her. Mm -hmm. Green tea. Look at Daddy in action. With the baby. It's like a father kangaroo. <laughs> Why are you shaking your head? <laughs> That's so cute. They have frozen string cheese. Little tiny Kobe Monterey. I think we should we should uh, switch up to getting a different flavor because we keep getting um, mozzarella for Emma. Let's try this one out, Ems. Do you like that one? It's got Emma. I mean, it's got frozen people. No? Look, it's Elsa and Anna and Olaf. Are you out? All right. Arby's! I'm so excited for their new um, loaded curly fries because it's it has bacon, cheese, and really delicious fries. I think Emma likes it too. And he's, she's like complaining right now. Look, look at that little tiny hand. That means she's asking for some snacks. She knows we're, we're at the drive-thru right now. You see that? She's like, mommy, give me some. That's so cute that our like, our server window drive-thru lady asked me what my nationality is. And she's like, my grandfather's Filipino. That's why I'm looking. It's so awesome. Filipinos everywhere, that's what Mike said. Like a cancer. <laughs> there it is! So good. Don't you just want to eat that all at once, you guys? <laughs> so good. Alright. need to clean this. It's dirty. Okay, yeah. so... <clears throat> how did we meet? That's the question. What year was it? It was 2012? 2011. 2011? Yes, January of 2011. Okay, it was January of 2011. And I have been working with uh, some Filipino counterterrorism guys in uh, General Santos City. Yes, I am from Jensen. I, uh... We finished up work that day and we, um, you know, we were looking to go out and the Filipino guys wanted to show me some of the local culture and stuff. So the first place they, uh, they took me and another American guy was this like girly bar and we were like, no, that's not what we're looking for. Girly bar? That's yeah. how you call it? <laughs> yeah, we were looking for something normal. It's a strip club. That's where they took him. So then uh, the second place they took us, we went um, We went to and... Another strip club and that's where you met me. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, just kidding. Um, it's, uh, it's on the second floor, so I walked up the stairs and I poked my head in because I wanted to see if uh, it looked like a good place. And um, when I poked my head in, Stephanie was on stage and she was talking to the crowd. And uh, she said, what did you say to me? I said, sir, where are you going, sir? No, oh, where are you going, I would, sir? I must. I have a band, and yeah. I'm working in the, in a small pub in Jensen. And while he was while he poked his head in, I was um, entertaining the guests and like you know like talking to them. And then I saw him like his his goofy little head poking in the door, and um, 
and then he kind of left. So I'm like, sir, sir, where are you going, sir? It's so funny too, because that night, there's like a lot of international people. There's like Indians, Americans, um, Japanese guys. Uh -huh. It's like a night of international. Oh. <laughs> and then it just so happened that you went in there too. So the important part of that though is when <laughs> Stephanie told me like and she said where are you going sir I thought that that was like a special thing <laughs> I didn't think that she like addressed the audience I thought she was just like you know she saw me and she was like oh there's a cute guy and she you know she was trying to like make sure I was gonna stay <laughs> so I thought she liked me which was totally false <laughs> And then, uh, so I went back downstairs, I got the rest of the guys, and we all came up, and we, uh, we got some tables, and we started watching the, uh, the performance of the cover band, where Stephanie was the lead singer. And then, um, you know, after 20 or 30 minutes, we had a couple drinks, and we were watching the show, they, uh, the band takes a break, and... I see Stephanie go over to like the the cashier the cashier like on the side and there's this uh, old Filipino guy next to me and he asks if I like Stephanie and I'm like yeah I think she's you know I think she's pretty and he's like do you want me to introduce you so I thought that like maybe he knew her or something but um, anyway so I I uh, I turned him down. I didn't let the old guy introduce me, and I went over by myself, and I said hi to Stephanie, and I uh, I got her phone number, and then uh, we spent the rest of the night because she was done seeing. My, by the way, my mom, my sister, and my best friend was there. Yeah, the so she was. I met him. She was sitting with them, yeah. and I was sitting on the opposite side of the of the restaurant or the pub, and uh, we were texting. You know what he first texted, texted me? Texting goofy, <laughs> goofy stuff. He was like, I don't know if you believe this, but I think I believe in love at, at first sight now. <laughs> <laughs> and he was like doing this, doing that, <laughs> like face. So cute, so uh, cute. We were like texting each other, like, and we're just like, I don't know, 20 feet away from each other. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was pretty cool. So we we texted a whole bunch, and then at one point I convinced her to go uh, outside to talk to me for a little while, and uh, that's when I found out that she was like in school, and some of uh, some more details about her. And then, uh... Then my best friend, he was, he like came out to grab me. Because he was like, you have to go inside, you can't stay out here. People will think you're like a prostitute talking to a <laughs> white guy outside the bar. <laughs> yeah. They were like, they were so skeptical of him <laughs> back then because, you know, the, the reputation of some white guys in the third world in the Philippines, like, they just take advantage of those, of like, some women. Yeah. Yeah, and like, they're scared, my family was scared that he, I'll be one of the victims. Yeah, you should be scared. So anyway, then, uh, to make a long story short, Stephanie and her friends, they left that place and they went to another, like, party, like a street party thing and ended up getting pizza. And we, uh, me and the guys, we followed him, and uh, I ended up talking to Stephanie a little bit more and getting ridiculed by her sister, because <laughs> her sister didn't like me and was skeptical of my intentions. Um, and then uh, that was, you know, that was it for the night that I met her. And then uh, a couple weeks later, you know, after emailing and stuff, we... Uh, we were able to kind of link up and uh, have an actual date, and that was when we uh, we sort of started dating. That's the story. 
and then you proposed to me. <laughs> yeah, there's, there was some stuff in between there. <laughs> huh? That's the story. What you gonna, what you gonna do with that dessert? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, what is wrong with you? <laughs> oh, that was fun. Did I scare you? Yeah, you got me. <laughs> so for dinner tonight, we're making uh, orange chicken pasta. Benji's orange chicken pasta. I think this is the first time we're using a recipe from uh, from Benjamin TV. Uh, I'm pretty excited though, because it looks really good. Me too. I'm excited. I'm a fan of citrus fave flavor. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised you said you're excited. Why? Because you're not a fan of citrus. I, I like chicken though. <laughs> okay, you have something on your teeth. Oh. <laughs> Is it there? Is There's it? nothing on the tea. <laughs> You're such a nerd. I love you. Say ah. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm gonna do some uh, video editing and uh, go to sleep. Have a good one. We'll see you tomorrow.